hey guys welcome back to my channel i just wanted to come today and show you guys how i prep my hair to be washed before my retie so next to me here i have my handy dandy colorful rubber bands i'll be using i do still have some smaller locks in the back and on the sides um and i have one up front i'll insert a little clip of those that way you guys can see so i do put those in um smaller braids first and then what i normally do is then i'll add it into a big braid before i actually braid and band so right now i have my hair section off we'll turn hopefully you can see that so i'm going to put two braids back here um two or three here and then about four up top So to get these little ones back here, they're um, actually locking pretty good. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to test the waters. They're a pretty good length, but I'm going to test the waters back here and I'm not going to break them single just to see if they stay in. I know, I know, I probably shouldn't be doing it, but I mean, it has been a few months since a since um all of these were created the one in the middle back here is the one that was the last one created and that was probably about a month or two ago so i'm gonna test the water then i'm not gonna do my little braids in the back and see how it goes so part it down the middle i just rake through my hair a little bit just to make sure everything is nicely separated I'm going to take this, <clears throat> make sure you guys can see. I don't like to braid the root um, too tight, that way I can still get my fingers in there. While shampooing, that way I can massage the shampoo through. But I just braid it down. And I don't go all the way down because I don't want to fight getting the rubber band off. And I don't want to puncture the hair trying to take the braid down. So that's about as far as I'll braid it. Let me see if you guys can see. There's still some. Let's go this way. There we go. So all that is unbraided. Let me take the rubber band. I'll start where it's not braided and work my way down and then I'll fold it over the loose ends. So So the reason why I separate this section is in three is because pretty much the way you braid it, it ha is how it's going to stay. So I don't want that like middle part left open in the back. So that's why I try and be certain to do the at least the top part in three. That way it doesn't have that middle gap. So up front, I'm not sure if you guys can see, but I do have this one left out. I'm going to leave it out because it is like literally hanging on by a thread. So I'm sure it's going to come out soon. I knew when I grabbed it, I was like, dang, that one um, was never really that long before. But I'm going to hopefully try and keep it intact as much as I can to see if there's anything she can do to fix it as I do have my retie tomorrow. Sorry if you guys see the little flakes. My scalp is dry. I'm actually not gonna wash my hair until the morning. I'm just prepping it now. So what I'm gonna do um, before I actually wash it is I'm going to do um, light apple cider vinegar rings and hopefully that'll help with 
the dryness and the flakes well i'm sure it will um i haven't done it on my hair since i had sister locks but i have done it on my hair before and my kids hair so i know it works i just don't want to go to sleep smelling like it so i'm like i'll just spray some on right before i'll sit under a shower cap for about 15 minutes and then i'll hop in the shower and i'll wash my hair but um i'm actually not going to braid this one separate either just because i don't want to risk it pulling and doing the same thing as this one over here so i will be doing an update video um um i'll tell you that i'm eight months in but as far as like any other information i'm going to do an update in a separate video because i'm still pretty new to youtube so i haven't done any videos on my actual hair so this will be my first sister locks video but i'll do a sit down um after my retie i'll come back and show you guys my retie and then i will also um, just give you guys a little information and uh, some ups, some downs, cons, some pros. And we'll chit chat. And from here on out, I'll start doing at least monthly updates on my sister locks. I do have my mirror over there, guys. So if you are seeing me look off to the side, it's because I'm looking in the mirror. And in total, I have two, five, six, seven, eight, nine braids. Nine braids total. Let me do a little spin around. Get up close and personal for you guys. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will follow back up with you guys once I get my retie. I'll show you my fresh retie. And we will talk and chat about my journey over these last little over eight, eight months. All right, guys, till next time.